Today's journey took us up into the hills of Danvers Pen in the parish of St. Thomas. We were on a search for the Allhead Estate, an old colonial estate and farmer plantation. The Allhead Estate was one of the largest slave plantations in Jamaica. As it turned out, this journey was not what I expected. As with these types of adventures, there's always room for something to go terribly wrong, or I could make the discovery of a lifetime. Yeah, peeps, so looking at this already, we can already see that this is pre colonial construction right here. So I actually believe this story that this actually goes down onto the aqueduct. Alright, so we have a light. While my goal is finding and exploring our abandoned or historical places of interest and bringing our forgotten, ignored, or unknown history to the public, I so take guys, extra precautions during exploring, endeavoring use. always to leave everything as we find them. So while exploring these places might look appealing to most, my advice is make sure you are mentally and physically prepared for the unknown before you get started. Yeah peeps, it's like one of the easiest finds. We already find the aqueduct. If you look behind me, that's all aqueduct going down there. Already one of the biggest and largest aqueducts we have ever found. So we have follow it and see where it leads because they say it lead to the plantation. Alright guys, so we'll follow. If you enjoy these videos, I would appreciate you giving this video a thumbs up. It is most helpful in enabling me to continue to share my discoveries with you. Okay, look as if we have to walk on the next side guys. However, we have followed the aqueduct because it leads to all head. So in the meantime, here is some info about the all head estate and slave plantation. Watch this. In the late 1761, Thomas Hall returned to Jamaica to find his estates in great disorder and confusion, largely because of the severity of John Rossi. During his stay in Jamaica, his wife, Mary, died. All arranged his affairs and returned to London by September of 1764. By November 1772, Thomas All had died. Thomas All's second son, William, emigrated to Jamaica shortly before his father's death to pursue a career as a planter. The bulk of Thomas All's estate went to his oldest son, Hugh Kirkpatrick All. Hugh managed his estates from England through Cunningham, and the Cleland attorneys in Jamaica, and John Kenyon is agent in London. In 1782, in addition to the Irwin and Trial estates in St. James Parish, H.K. Hall owned the Kirkpatrick Hall estate located in the parish of Westmoreland. In 1793, records show an additional sugar plantation called Allhead Estate in the parish of St. Thomas in the east. In 1790, Mistress Alice Kenyon took over management of her late husband's business affairs and by 1807 was managing Arled Estate. In 1811, Arled Estate was owned by Mistress Alice Kenyon and Thomas Gordon and in the possession of John Stewart and Charles Harris. In 1821, Arled is the property of John Arl, son of H.K. Arl, brother of Thomas Arl and Thomas Gordon. An aqueduct is a structure that is used to transport water across a valley. However, in modern terms, an aqueduct can be constructed using pipes, ditches, canals, and even tunnels. Although the Romans were considered the first and the greatest aqueduct builders, they were used in ancient Persia, India, Egypt, amongst other places in the past. Yeah, yeah guys, so we are still water on the other side, yeah, we'll go over the next side, but it looks like water run off over that side and it just run over the next side, so we have to come back on that side. No problem. As we walked along, we thought we were walking through eh? mud, but we had no idea of what we were about to face yeah, further along the way. <laughs> this aqueduct, my like friends, was one of the me? first and the most magnificent of its time, with an exception to the island aqueduct yeah. right here in St. Thomas, which is the largest on the island. 
Yeah, peeps. Yeah, you know, say so like boat truck of water. <laughs> like we literally are walking on water now. We still aren't sure whether it was built the same time as the plantation house or whether it was built before. Guys, so to find out make it out from the next side, we're gonna follow the aqueduct and you know, follow me. If you really like adventure videos, consider subscribing to the channel with the red subscribe button down below. Alright? I wanna thank those of you who donate to the channel, who donate credit, who donate cash and kind to the channel. Alright, really a blessing. Yeah man, no follow me. Guys, remember also that there will be questions at the end of the video. So no pay attention. I could not get eye peeps like we are see the real I could not know. Mm -hmm. People shout out to Zumba you know. Man, uh, yeah man, big up to the whole Antigua too. Every time. Blessings. Know everybody. Blessings. Yes. Yes, you know? There are other aqueducts in Jamaica, Water. such as the Mona and the Papin Aqueduct, which has been declared national monuments. Mm -hmm. This makes one wonder why the others have been omitted. What about those in St. Thomas? At this point, I couldn't help wondering why it seems that the parishes with an abundance of water are the parishes with severe water shortages. Communities are struggling without adequate supplies of water while big corporations are allowed to use vast amounts of water by channeling into or diverting rivers and the springs for their own purposes. Enormous amounts of water can be seen tumbling over the sides of this aqueduct, creating pools of unusable water that saturates acres of land into swamps that in turn creates ideal breeding ground for mosquitoes Apple and beer, dog. diseases. Look at Apple beer, I'm going to on the ground. This waste of valuable water resources not only creates water shortages, but it also causes pollution in streams, mm -hmm. rivers, the waterways, leaving communities. So we are climbing even water. Up. Yes. We are now at the top of the aqueduct. There is the aqueduct, and it makes a corner here. So the aqueduct. Stick in a corner and turn in a canal now, so we'll follow it until it becomes a kudok again heading down to the plantation. Alright, peeps. So I saw them get the water you know, from the river and they realize that. Yeah. You see how far it come from? Wow. Peeps, so we know that we are going to a rather large plantation. Alright, I'm gonna put a picture on screen of how the plantation was in the 1700s. Alright, peeps, let's check out this. Rubbish going down. Beer garbage. Beer garbage. I feel Charlie, I want to take you on go somewhere else. Mm-hmm. Peeps are going uphill and the water still around. Notice? Yeah, peeps. Following the aqueduct from the community, it then continues into the thick bushes. Really want to say thank you to the person who gave us information about this site. Yeah. Eh? Oh, dude, oh, dude. Oh, Rona. Come like a free the coat, you know, dog. Oh, yeah. No, I'm not really free the animal that I'm not free I'm just a cow, dude. Oh. I'm cow now. Okay. Yeah, peeps. And the interesting thing is that William Alf, he actually had three plantations. One in Westmoreland, one in Monique in St. Andrew, and one in St. Thomas. So when they did the portrait 
of of the of the plantation space. I look down because they come and look at another thing on the water over there and ditch over there. So yeah, when they did the portrait of the plantation, of the Arlette plantation which we are going to, at one point person said that it was a plantation in Westmoreland, they said that it was a plantation in Monig. However, his son came back and did the, another portrait of the St. Thomas plantation. And then, like it was peeps, I'm not going to read about it, alright? I'm going to put links in the description below. And the aqueduct trap walk from a wall right here. It looks like a runoff where some of the water actually run off going down there. You have put here another water here, bro? You have put here another water? Go on, go on, go on. Them iron make a long time, you know? Peeps, you know, see that? Yo, I can't deal with heights now. Go on, bro, I'm going to Yeah, Peeps. Go here, run, go down this way. See them metal bricks, the peeps? Built to last. Tunnel. Yeah man, go on the one tunnel. In terms of that. So guys, the aqueduct has actually gone. As I walked along, I began to imagine our ancestors and their children toiling under the whip. As they are forced to construct this mammoth structure. And then forced down the narrow passageways to clean the various water channels. They may have service here where them service the aqueduct, is it? And plug and plug. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I think I'm going to have them every couple feet. Peeps, here's another one going even deeper down into a tunnel right here. Water down in there, though? Yeah. And tell us no water, tell me, yeah. Water down in there, man. All right, peeps, so this is another one. Peeps actually heard about this aqueduct the year that it was working, but we never knew would have find all of this. Another one. It steps going down inside also. This one looks as if it was refurbished recently. Mm, so we did it now and open now. We reach us and we see one wire fence. So it looks like we have to go through also. Forget to go up our other peeps. So yeah. We see my way through already. With my fear of cows, I tried to find every excuse not to travel on ahead. Stop worry about that and I walk. And look for the sitting room. I'm on my own, broken along. I feel the rain crashing down. Yeah. All around this empty town. Yeah, man, man. We're searching for the lost and found. But you don't care you are being on the way Yeah. 
Aka di sana dulu. Hip, boleh pakau. Dah di mana ni mawon man? Peeps, so all of the sound them away here from this side from now just a man around cold and so you can imagine how much cold that down there so can watch how cold that slap us now I'm going to have one already That good man, you know how you do You just wait and see watch how it pass so that's another one right there, another entrance to the aqueduct. So it looks like the aqueduct has got down some spillway, that's why we're here sound, is it? Mm. So we are still have a follow so the aqueduct. Keep on us the aqueduct, it's now a canal. We just hope it lead way to the plantation because we really want to see that. And we've been walking for a while. We're about half a mile, so we still have to go down and see if we can reach. But coming out of private property, we actually are here people, we actually are see people now. Alright, so we go see if people we can talk to. Big man! Elite, elite. The old slavish chocolate place, there, man. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. Yeah. I'm a here. Control with the full people. This is my work now, work here, so the shoes. You can't wait, you know? Come on, we got a pit of the field. We got a up. We got a um. We only spend the money. Five meter, five meter, five meter spring. That's how we got um. Pointing and go on. Yeah, man. We got double now. That's a few of us over here to inside. We got a pass. so I want great house we have a really thick well two now because the, the Robert Lightburn also for Foley yeah. you know so that was a great house before even Robert Lightburn lived there yeah that's how they cut it then alright but what people don't know still 15 cents great house over there and you can pack the foundation up at the foundation and over there okay, okay. And them yeah. column the big sign up them two house yeah man alright okay. them two house the way up and for the, for the side of the back house the tobacco arm here. Yeah. The two outs are actually being thinner, the great outs, like the big. Uh, so, watch the video, they must see some outs, they'll find out. So, yeah. big outs here. Big, bigger than them, we're also uh, set for that over there. Big. Okay. They have three outs, three outs, building in our little place, so that's the reason why we're building. 
We're gonna walk up a mountain. Come on, almost find all of them in our skeleton coming soon. You find the compact though. Yeah, it wasn't probably more. No, 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 what's the point? Yeah, peeps, so it looks like we have some water for water, so no problem. I just the other day, so we'll go up on the hill, I'll mash up the next night here, and now the one here, out to go to. Water and mud was the least of our problems, right, yeah. for we soon found ourselves mm -hmm. in a literal swamp. Where we actually uh, see the aqueduct again, and it's a part of it. You can see a old construction that keeps like really old. So we have followed the water same way. Shoes are get wet and all of that, but you know it go. Yeah. Tall pier. Yeah. Uh, I'm so much over there, so yeah, so. <laughs> Peeps, sorry about my language, but no. Yeah. Hmm? Yeah. What is it? Yeah. 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 Yeah man, come through. Yeah peeps, them say come over here still now, but you know we have to reach the way of the sun. That way I know. Mm -hmm. I tell you peeps, mud. Come like it now, stop though. No. Yeah. Mm hmm Peeps are only for mud to come through, you know. And the mud come like it now, stop. Go lay over the money, they're right in your son. Here's the aqueduct, guys. One day down the bottom, one day up the top. The water around down in the bottom. Yeah peeps, so run away, follow me. Yeah peeps, it seems like we are getting closer and closer. Alright, yeah man. 
if the aqueduct so big, right? Traveling from so far, it even bring water uphill. You can imagine the plantation houses, the great house, the structures on the plantation. Peeps, me can't wait for reach. Can you follow me? If you are follow me, let me know in the comment section below. Alright? Yeah man. If you are subscribed already, type subscribe in the comment section below. If you haven't yet subscribed, let me know. And if you just subscribe, let me know too. Alright? Now follow me. So peeps. The aqueduct over there, but there's no truck, so we have to take a truck and go around on it. We'll go back to all of them things in a picture of the second tree, like seriously. Anyway, you follow me. Then, just as I was thinking about the journey back out of this wilderness and the mosquito infested swamp, mud, and water, I saw something out of the corner of my eyes. I don't know. <laughs> Peeps, we don't know what is refined enough. This looks like some storage area or something. Didn't expect to find this. A big structure behind it now. A big structure behind it? Yeah. You sure? Yeah, I see it right there. Yeah, I see it That's that's another aqueduct, that's an building or something. Go through the bush. As yet unknown to me, I was about to discover one of the largest ruins in western St. Thomas. But between us and the enormous structure was a jungle of eagle claw thorns, or kashamaka, that appears to engulf the structure mm -hmm. like an armor. There was no way to get to the wait, structure, wait, wait, but wait, to go wait, through wait. the armor like thorns. We had to find a way around this. Like we find all the estate and slave plantation. We find one of the house them, but it overgrown still in a piece. So now I come so far and now we look on the building them. Like come, follow my peeps. Take it wide for cut back in. Go on, so go on, so go on, so we are go. Alright. Oh, the water mill now. That's the water wheel there. That's the beef. That's the now we put no other building there, so this is alone there, so no? I'm more building that over there, so no? Yeah, that metal, man. Like a tree of the building, and then they threw that bush. bush. Oh, thanks, there, so. Yeah, peeps. We we'll find something this and that at the same building there, realize? Yes. So go down there. That's how my friend will stop me today, no, peeps. Part of our house. 
Your peeps say this will look like a part of a house. The Makaya go on bad still, Nabel. Hmm? Makaya go on bad. Oh, look here, 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 Oh, I see him we have a class for us. Come on, look on this one. Move that on this one. Look, sir. See a wall settlement down there, so I'm not sure how I check out this first. Alright, let's see how sneaky. Alright, so follow me. This is another piece of a structure, guys. Wall it, you know? You know, sir, the place where I look for the great house this morning. You know? Apes, it seems as if it seems as if we're actually in the great house at the moment. That's why I'm not testing a piece of the soldier, some piece at the front of the house. Mm. I'll show you something. There's other construction over here, guys. Alright, so. Yeah. Apes, I'm not sure. I'm not sure what is out here. I'm going to have a look to see that looks like some. Thank you. Move on, 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 This here look fine. Yeah. How are this here look fine? So? What is this? Where are we looking? I saw big it No man, no, look. See a little structure there when I show you now. That is a little structure behind us now. What this big piece is sitting here? Alright, come go so, go so. Look, take this side there. Take this side there. Take this side between you, look. Take the bone between you, so. Okay then. So, look. I could have. I got there. I think it's not Mr. Kino. I think I'll see that. I could have. I could have. I could have. I could Construction, this you know. Uh -huh. more construction right here. I'm standing on. So the aqueduct stop up there, so the water mill there. This is what I'm is a water mill. They all say down there, so bro. They all say down there, so. So, peeps, in this location that we are at, this was where the water mill was. Alright, so the water, the water wheel would have been somewhere here. Alright, this is a spillway coming down from the aqueduct. The aqueduct stop up there. I'm asking if I can reach further up. Here, sir. Uh -huh. Yeah man, you can reach up it, yes. Yeah, 
it's here again more construction right here all right so this was definitely where the water mill was because they wouldn't have built the aqueduct they wouldn't have built the aqueduct coming down into their house it's top of the mill so the house is gonna be more likely down there all right so we'll go down further after we get this i'm gonna show you guys this here. follow me Yeah guys, this is really huge. This is one of our most, this is one of our biggest finds so far. Original height of the aqueduct now. Mm -hmm. Yeah peeps, this seems to be the original height of the aqueduct. Alright, really one. Okay, safe. I see something to them. Yeah guys, so if you notice guys, this is the height of the aqueduct. Very high peeps. Yeah. piece of construction of the see that? Uh -huh. Alright. So maybe we can do for the house and the desk still in there, is it? Because we have to hold for construction. Look guys, more construction here. But the thing is the construction we're looking for it was down in the plane. So I think it is down there. Not up here. Alright. So I'm gonna look right this one. Follow me. Alright, this is a part of the So peeps, we literally lost in the bush, like seriously, we don't know how to reach back from the road. Be a bush winner, that place is big. Hey Piece of construction that you have on all of it, yeah? Mm -hmm. Piece of construction that you have on. Can you feed that in us, sir? 
So we have three more oats going down the line. Thank you, dad. Pips, you know what, sir? Yeah, if anybody tell me, sir, to walk through the bush, you wouldn't find this, you know? Pips, so that's part of the great house right there. Is this truck down there, sir? So the river was all the problem in the peeps because if, if you notice the pic that I showed you, it was actually built on the river edge. So the river wash away a lot of the building. You know? Like I think a couple of the houses were washed away. So this is the great house guys. Alright then maybe. Hmm? What? I'm sitting there. What them do you see? Them ball is sitting there on the tree. I don't know. Peeps? <laughs> We don't know what you're talking about that. This is the construction of the great house. So, yeah, peeps. Yeah, guys, so, this is the structure right here. This looks as if it was front columns. All right, going up there. There's another wall up there. Then we have. This is also another part of the house. Peeps with a way in a bush in a one. No, guys, that's one of the larger walls of this house because it was a really big house. All right, peeps? This was a humongous house. Had a little flat this way in the depot, you know. Remember the picture I'm show you? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hmm? Oh, yeah, peeps. This is a part of the house. Man, oh, I didn't saw a room that's still there, is it? Mm -hmm. Alright. So. Look at structure up in the center. Hmm? And get yeah. Where? Right. Come go look. See through gear right there, sir. Look so. Mm-hmm. Look a cow pasture get. That the road though, that's it. You hear something? No, yeah, man, you're something like the move, but like the move, yeah, the road out there, sir. Uh-huh, true. The thing is, we don't know if the riverbed is there, so back in the days, is it? It could have been further, further back. Okay. You see nothing, you see nothing down there, sir. You glimpse nothing down there, sir, not at all. No. Come on, go back on the front. Anybody know the correct name for this plant? Let me know in the comment section below. That's an elite Jamaica question. So, we ventured the more we found a city like site. Because having researched this, this site in depth, I thought I knew what to expect. But being here, this is the old road around the totally totally house, them up on the next side, right beside it. Now you know what the map not change, bro. The drive go right out to the riverside up at the picket fences, them there where them have the picket fence them. So some of them also go the block down still right in the middle of the because bush do that too, you know. Bush are dangerous or something I want to check it out, you know. Right in us them there. Oops. For once we read the map good. We'll find the rest of the house them peeps and watch this. Yeah guys, so well on the more house out over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What? Check them out first. Guys. <laughs> Yo. Guys, we find something like something outstanding up there. So we'll see how this is. Look for me. Because you know what? You know what? You know what? You know what? 
Them brick look pretty boy, man. Mm -hmm. oh, love to see them if they knew. Yo! Original iron and you was on it. Take one picture. Yo, up on top of the thing with the old sea front. You know that thing out of the six? Metal this enough. Real metal enough. Come on. Come on, I can marry that. This is our top part? Mm hmm. Guys, this is the top of one of the structures that we had seen from the front. Alright, look on type of construction and look how long it there. Alright. Yeah peeps. This is something now. Now go around this. This is something. This is something like part of my water wheel, all this. Huh? Hold the camera. Yeah. Yeah, I'll go over here, sir. Come here, come here, camera. You find something. I'm not sure why it is. Tips, I don't know about this, you know. but apart of some mechanical device, you know, that they used to use. This look like a part of the water wheel, you know, see, one piece, two piece, three piece, a piece of the water wheel, listen, peeps. This did round. <laughs> Let me take a picture. A part of the water wheel, bro, it did round. You see them fin there, you see? I'll let you hold on one of the fin there, you know. Peeps, Jano, one of our largest finds, peeps. Look at those bricks. Still standing. Still standing. And I block them, block it up. You can realize I block them, block it up. Now, mm -hmm. is it? Because we don't know why in there. Why in there? Mm -hmm. idea? Honestly, I don't know what this was, but this is inside of the building. Yeah, peeps. I don't know what was inside here, but that's it. In there. Yeah, man, we're going there. There's another piece of the building right there, peeps. Yeah, man, this was a really great house. Very big. So, our next piece to over this again, peeps. You're that bigger than we think, you know. Mm -hmm. The camera show you brighter more time, you know. It's eye out. Yeah, peeps, this is the inside of this structure. This was the house, peeps, as you can see. There is no denying that fact that this was the house. You know, the walls match the dimension, dimensions of a house. Here is more metal. They use a lot of metal in another building, you know. And this like look like some of them beat down. A lot of metal. So peeps, this is actually our biggest find. We can sign off on this as being our greatest find. Here in the Allhead Estate and Slave Plantation. 
if this one was really hard this was well hidden but this feels like virgin territory no one has been here for a while we really enjoy this one if you enjoyed this video guys type enjoy in the comment section down below French wall. A fence used to there.